Hey guys, what's up? This is uh, Dim Sum 41. Um, I kind of broke my phone. I put up a video earlier, like a while ago. Turns out, like a week later, my phone broke. Well, I saw a video on YouTube and it uh, didn't exactly help me out too much because there was a screw missing. So here it is. I'm taking apart my phone and repairing it myself. As you can hear, already hear it. Something's definitely not cool there. So we're going to start by taking everything off. Take off the back panel and the battery. And what you're going to need is a T6 wrench. Oh no, you can see that. Oh. Yeah, T6 wrench, you want to take off the four screws here. This will void your warranty, so you might want to uh, consider everything first. There's going to be four. One there. One over here. Got to do this within like eight minutes. Oh god. Okay. Um. Here. Oh gosh. And one more here. Four screws. I'm gonna put it off to the side. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to need to get one of these so you can safely remove uh, the panel safely and fast somehow all right that should easily come off shouldn't be a problem put that off to the side for a little bit now you're gonna have to take off one more screw which is on the top over here this is what the other video forgot to tell you. I almost broke my phone, which was pretty upsetting. Now they're all the same size, so it doesn't really matter where you put them. And once again, you're going to, oh gosh, want to take this whole, the motherboard part. Now there is, as you can see, a ribbon. You need to disconnect that that off to the side you're going to need to see my ribbon came off got cut off this would have been connected here it connects the LCD screen to the motherboard piece of crap what you're gonna want to do now is remove the four screws as indicated that I'm going to take off right now. Oh, with a regular screwdriver, not a T6. These are four silver screws, regular Phillips. Should be able to take care of it. This is my second HTC phone. I had a wizard before this. I love my wizard. But it is a brick. I love the tilt. It is better than the iPhone, in my opinion, of course. But whatever floats your boat. Now that should just easily come off like that. Put that off to the side. Now you're gonna need to take off these four screws. Here. These two are Phillips. It would take a Phillips screwdriver to take it off, so no other special tools needed. The part that I had to replace was called um, a flex cable. That took a while for me to find for a pretty good price. Some places charge 60 bucks for it. Some charge 40. I found on eBay for 30 with free shipping. But it come from it comes from Hong Kong, so 
once you do that you're going to need this again just take it off probably not making a good video as at the moment Oh, that's not cool. I just broke it. Yeah, you guys might want to be careful when you uh, take this thing apart. Don't be like me. Don't rush it. That is so not cool. Jeez, guy. Alright. Here we go. Let's just uh, put that back together. You're going to need to. There is a ribbon here. I'm going to need to uh, flip that open. Once you flip that open, uh, see that? Once you flip that open, you can pull it right out. Once you pull that right out, you can, uh, all right, there is one more screw here. Oh, I lied. Three more screws. Now there will be two parts of this because it is running out of time. Running out of space, I mean. Because I'm so slow. And two more screws. Let me just uh, go ahead and stop this, and I'll be back when I take these screws out. <laughs> 